good morning. See if I can remember what's in here. Okay, so before I open, there's two different kinds of clay. I, I still have the smooth, the Tucker's smooth, speckled, and this time I've got some red, and it's non-grog, and it's Tucker's red, smooth. So we'll see how the glazes look with those on. All right, top. Oh, that's beautiful. Another one of these. This is always a big seller. <laughs> this is... Um, Ancient Jasper and Texture Turquoise with one of my new rolling pins. Sharon Hoffy rolling pin. Lovely. Very good. That's awesome. Good one. And really exciting I did. Um, Ancient Copper. Oh, nice and slushy caramel. That's um, and Light Flux. All I did was put two coats of Ancient Copper and a really light coat of Light Flux. That's and new. no drippies. And that's my brown clay. Nice one. <laughs> and um, I did a soap dish. Um, this I made one before. It's just fog um, with the same colors, and they sold quickly. So I made another one. Nice and All right, these are two bowls, matching bowls. River Rock and Texture Turquoise. Oh, that's so pretty. I love it when it does that. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh, close. Nice. Yes, lots of drippy layers of texture turquoise and two even coats of river rock. And it's over the red clay? Yeah, it's red. But do yeah. You, so would you think the glaze is yeah, any different? Yeah, it, it, it does. It's, it, it shows up just a little bit different, just a bit darker. But that's cool. Nice one. Usually I do handles on my bowl, but this is a pair of no handles. Okay, I want to show you what's below this too. This is just the base. I created a plant pot. It's the base. This is honey flux. And no, yeah, honey flux, oatmeal, and ancient copper. That's really pretty. Okay, I can't wait to see the rest of it. Hopefully, it didn't drip. We're good. All right, this is the rest of it. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool. Ooh, honey flux, um, and uh, oatmeal and ancient copper. That's cool. That's really neat. Is that pretty? And I created. So let's see, as a plant pot, there's holes. There we go. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, that's so nice. It's, I think there's a fine line. You don't want it too distracting because it's meant for plants. I don't want um, your eyes to be so much on the plant pot as it will be on the plants that are going to come through there. Awesome. <laughs> that's very cool. Um, a whole bunch of little, I don't know, somebody asked for little wine glasses, so I did a whole bunch of these. It's just um, Honey Flux. Uh, Blue Reptile and Merlot in there. Oh, no, it was just Sapphire Float. Sorry, just Sapphire Float with Honey Flux. Okay. And I did a different process just for fun. I put this wax on it that dries quickly. I carved my name and then put um, uh, a Speedball Black um, Matte Glaze in there and then fired it. So then it comes, my name is written on in, in, in the first time I've experimented with putting the glaze on my name. Oh, that's cute. Okay, this is Honey Flux and Myrtle, um, Raspberry. Raspberry Mist. Raspberry Mist. And this one? Okay. All right. Oh, it's on brown. Okay, I did a set of these for my friend Jan, and she bought them for a, a wedding gift. And it was on white, and it does look different. It was much lighter, but this is still very pretty. Um, okay. Uh, red, where's my bowls with that? Okay, Honey Flux, two coats, Emerald Falls, two thirds of the way down, Textured Turquoise, one third, and Satin Orbe on the rim. And that's the pretty blue that drips down. That's really pretty. Ooh, love that. Little handles. Nice. Good one. I have a whole pile of mugs, all neatly fit tight, if I can remember what I put. Um, oh, okay. Um, my sister-in-law, Trisha ordered two of these, so I made three. It's um, Deep Fire Brick textured, um, Texture Amber Brown. It's the glossy one with Ancient Jasper. Um, she wanted two, so I made three. Oh, and it's on brown clay. So I've done this before a few times, and it sells quickly, but it's just a little bit richer on brown clay. Nice. I like that a lot. If you like brown, I love it. Yes. Um, 
I made these because they always sell. Norris Blue, Peacock. I do four coats of that Peacock Celadon because it just looks so much better. Um, and that's the rim of... Um, uh, Galaxy. Yes, it's Galaxy. I did too. They always sell. Like, they're one of the first to sell. So I'll just have that. Uh, George wanted... George and Deb wanted two more of these, so I made three, of course. Honey Flux. They're on the white clay because I, I have this... I know how it's going to turn out with um, Merlot and Blue Reptile. I did three. So choose the two you want. And then one more. What did I do? Um, Blue Reptile times two. Textured Turquoise. Iron Luster. And a Light Flux. Just I put a little bit of Light Flux to pull that down. Nice. Super nice brown clay. That's what I was looking for when I research what it's going to look like. That's what Blue Reptile does on brown clay. Very pretty. Like the shape? It's kind of neat. Here we go! And that's my latest opening. Can I say? That's super cool. I just built this around balloons. I threw up three balloons and worked through them. 